up from the bed again. I just came back from my morning walk. Um, uh, I did double today. I'm back feeling strong, feeling healthy. My knees and legs don't hurt as much. Um, I had company this time, and I was able to talk and pour out a lot of emotions and get some clarity on things by talking to shoot one of my best friends and life companions that I could ever ask. She's awesome. And you know, ran with me, well walked with me this morning. And I appreciate that. I feel left every <laughs> um we had a conversation about accepting reality. There are certain mental things that people go through, and myself included, where we think the worst out of every situation. You know, because of the past traumas we had, we just believe that it can only be bad, you know? But that ain't always the case. Most of the time, it is what it is. Gotta stop thinking about the terms of bad and good because those are subjective. Um, I think we want to really be in a space where am I do what am I doing and is this going to hurt anyone? I think we should reconsider the things we do if we know that it's going to hurt someone. Um, but there are some things that we do for us that we have no intent to hurt anyone that we do. And that's the difficult part. So we have to look at it as the people we love don't intend to hurt us, even though they do sometimes. We can't look at the negative and see only the negative. We can look at the positive, you know? Uh, somebody's being secretive or whatever, like in a relationship or whatever, instead of thinking maybe they're cheating until you find, you know, evidence otherwise. Maybe they're planning a surprise party or something. Never know. Open the possibility 